To everybody out there that was telling me to use Leviathan's Breast inside of this week's GM, you are right, absolutely. The funniest part of this is that I was having a really fun time with it, and I don't even have the catalyst. I don't use this thing. When I finished the quest for this way back in Shadow Keep, I think it was something like that i put it in the vault and literally never pulled it out of the vault until this week so yeah even without having the catalyst this thing was still putting in really good work and i always like to say that i have a lot of fun in this game wherever i find neat situations for certain weapons to shine the best instead of using the same ones across the board everywhere right so with everybody talking about how good levy's breath was inside of this week's gm i definitely wanted to take a swing with it even though i didn't have the catalyst for it now over the past couple of videos i've been talking about some pretty good weapons to use inside of this gm particularly because i sound like a broken record here but double rewards this week gms had updates that allow a lot more players to hop in so a good amount of people more than usual probably hopping into gms for the first time this season than normally when seasons first open up in the first video of course we talked about royal entry still swear by that rocket for gms with void burn and then i made a retrofit video had that stuff all good ready to go scheduled it for yesterday aka thursday and then of course wednesday they well, fucking nerfed it. Well, and then, <laughs> then they make that video look stupid. Either way, the last weapon that me and my homies wanted to test out was Leviathan's Breath. Now, like I said earlier in the clip, bro, me and my homies personally, we just never use this damn bow. None of us had the catalyst, okay? And even still, with none of us having the catalyst and this thing at its proper, strongest form, this thing actually was still surprisingly kicking ass, putting in that work, more so than you might think. One thing that does help this bow inside of GMs or any higher-end content, I guess, per se, would be that it does have intrinsic unstoppable. Now, granted, it is a bow in the heavy slot, so you won't ever catch me using this thing in any sort of raid content, but that is part of the reason why I do like GM so much. It gives me a reason to go a bit outside the box and just use some of my weapons and my arsenal that I generally just don't use, because I don't usually have a reason for it. Of course, Void Burn and unstops in this nightfall. It almost acts like a cosmic storm for the perfect situation to arise to have this bow in the perfect situation for it to look good and perform well. And I give it credit that because once again, this is literally the first time I picked up this gun in about three years. And for a bow that literally has zero in two stats, I would say this thing kicks ass, at least in this specific GM. Thank you guys so much for watching. Y'all be safe. You know what's funny? This is generally the champion.